So you want me to give you my hot take on brands like LG. Here's the reality when it comes to specifically LG, Samsung, or really any other major import brand. LG and Samsung make fine electronics. In fact, they make fine appliances, actually. Uh, they don't fail at any greater rate or any greater percentage than your domestic brands like Whirlpool or GE or Frigidaire, right? Where they fall short, where most import brands fall short is their service. And it's just a simple fact that they have not been in this country as long as brands like Whirlpool, Frigidaire, uh, or GE. These Those brands have been here for a hundred years, plus or minus, give or take. So the reality you have to face is that brands like LG and Samsung do not have the internal support or the structure that some of these legacy brands, these homemade brands, are going to have. And the reality is it depends on where in the country you go. If you go somewhere where there's an LG service center right down the street, you're gonna get a bunch of really happy people who love LG and you're gonna be fine. If you are going to go to a place where there, for example, in Southwestern Virginia, you can't get service on LG, even if it's under warranty. You just can't, it, it's not gonna happen. So what you need to do is when you go to purchase this appliance, I want you to ask the specific question, who services this appliance? Because here's the thing, LG doesn't have factory techs. Most manufacturers don't have factory techs. They have outside service agencies that they bring in and train. So the answer to your question might be, oh yeah, uh, Bob's Appliance Service takes care of LG in our area, they're really good. Or the answer might be, well, we don't really have a service center for LG in our area. So that's the key question. If I was shopping for LG appliances or Samsung or really any other non-domestic brand, that's the question I would ask.